All right. Looks like we need a refresher on housekeeping. We have maid service? No, Larry, we don't have maid service. Housekeeping is the responsibility of every one of us as team members. It helps to maintain a safe and efficient working environment. Do we have to clean this all up at the end of our shift? Oh, no. Actually, it's best to clean up throughout the shift. That way, messes like this don't pile up. That is one big mess. Yeah, and not only is it unpleasant to look at, it's also very dangerous for all of us. You realize you're pointing at Bob, right? Poor housekeeping can lead to all sorts of accidents. Tripping over loose objects, leaning against poorly stacked items, or even piercing or cutting your own skin. Mm. Now look, let's clean this up. Nice work. All right. Now let's check this out. Now here, we have an excellent example of effective housekeeping and a properly maintained workstation. See how it's free of clutter and any spills? This is effective use of space. Now our guys have complete control over their tools and materials. Plus, working this way reduces fire hazards, it reduces exposure to vapors and dust in the air, and it reduces property damage. Now, good housekeeping doesn't just apply to the job site. It also applies to you. Oh, my room's pretty clean, I guess. No, not your room, Larry. I'm talking about you. Your own personal maintenance. The way you treat your body actually has an impact here at work. Huh? It's true. Now let's start with the obvious, lifting heavy equipment. Always lift responsibly, either with your legs or with assistance straps, or even better, with someone else. Now don't try to be a macho hero and take it on by yourself, because taking it on by yourself can lead to an injury and that could take you out of commission. Seriously! Will somebody please help Bob? And if you do some heavy lifting, give yourself a nice stretch afterwards. Now listen, it is important to be properly rested before your next day. Get the rest you need to tackle the day refreshed and rejuvenated. Now look, some of our work sites get pretty hot, especially during the summer months. So stay hydrated. Caffeinated beverages will dehydrate you. H2O is your best option. Now even the little things can make an impact, like hygiene for example. Did you know that better hygiene leads to improved overall health? You smell fine, Larry. What I'm saying is that with better housekeeping both on the job and at home, we're going to lead ourselves to more productivity and even boost morale. Boom. Now, let's take the things we've learned so far and apply them. 